correct people we greet you now welcome now to this our channel if that's the first time when they work at jam this our channel make you now follow us make you now like our page and make you now help us to share our videos oh now listen now oh we'll get updates updated news breaking news correct correct so we now we they carry on for now for you so if you never subscribe to our youtube channel make you now rush go subscribe and also turn on the notification bell so at any time we'll be like say we drop updates on our be notified anyway my people Make we enter the updates and the Tori we will carry come for now like this. We gonna watch. Yes, yeah, so my people. Well, Sunday service. Pastor Tunde Baka we shook mouth in some mubad matter. Where begin analyze the name and analyze the lifestyle. <laughs> he said, no, no, say the harvest go come soon. But inside the comments we make on to mubad matter, by matter. Hmm. Not be smart reactions. Don't follow that uh, statement. To don't to dick yourself. Don't come and blast and not be small. My people, I go play on this video now. Now watch the way we arise. They analyze this whole matter. Waiting pastor to the back of a talk. Had different comment and all. Look on our watch and make don't forget to like and share. Watch the video. Have you know more bad? Huh? The Nigerian artist who died at top twenty-seven. Uh, uh, more bad. Uh, more, more, more bad when he was drinking and smoking and associating with uh, evil men. Uh, he does not know that the, 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 the harvest will come so soon and he'll be caught down in the prime of youth. I'm not blaming him. I'm not. Bl I'm just telling you, it's more bad than good name. More bad. The harvest. He didn't know the harvest will come so soon. I mean, I personally, I felt that was quite insensitive. There's so, so many other examples that could be used to deliver his message. Ayo, but of course, you know that this has caused a lot of uh, reactions. Let me take one tweet. Uh, this person wrote in responding to uh, Pastor Bakari. Mobad is just a nickname. He chose to imply that he's an extremely great musician. This is what it means. For example. When it comes to data analysis, I bad gone. That statement in Pigeon means I am an awesome analyst. This pastor is misunderstanding the name. I mean, I'm glad for that clarification. I mean, I hope that Tunde Bakare will know what that means as well. But I mean, it means other things, Ayo. Yes. But also, you know that Tonto Dike, who has been a great advocate for this um, Justice for Mubad uh, movement, also posted a tweet online. And, you know, it's a, it's a lengthy tweet. She wrote, uh, you know, Dear Pastor Tunde Bakare, when your colleagues are caught in on holy sexual activities, we never hear your voice. Only when it comes to the death of a boy who is old enough to be your last born, you say he reaped the reward of his actions. What actions? Please keep the same energy with your colleagues, she said, and you know, preach your gospel and leave Mubad's name out of your administration. Dr. Abati, over to you. Oh, okay. I think contest is important here. As always. Now, why do I say contest? Uh, pastor Tunde Bakari is a pastor, a priest. What do uh, you know, uh, pastors do? They preach about salvation, they preach about uh, morality, they preach about the saving of souls, right? Yes. And in this particular case, he's complaining basically about two things, drinking, smoking, which seems to be the main stream culture, you know, particularly with hip hop parties, with the creative space in Nigeria. So you don't expect him to praise, you know, that kind of lifestyle that we see, which as I have argued also on the back page of this day today, you know, appears to be a major problem in the uh, creative sector in Nigeria. A lot of people drinking, smoking, joining gangs, occultism and all of that, you know, and we even had a guest here, Tennyson Brown, who as an industry person also drew attention to that. So a pastor moralizing about lifestyle, I think is consistent with his uh, calling. The second issue in terms of context also, you as uh, or someone you quoted is saying, Oh, bad means that oh, I'm really very good. I'm an extremely I'm, I'm, great I'm a, I'm analyst. A very That's good what he means. But you know, it, there's also a generational gap here. Okay. I mean, Pastor Bakari who should be, you know, in his late sixties. Uh, if a young man goes around him and he say Mubad, Mubad, he, he will say you are going about proclaiming that you are bad. <laughs> he, he, he could just take it literally. Mm. You don't expect him to fit into your own, you know, zone of signification. So that's where he's coming from. 
However, where you may uh, express uh, concern is that that old Sophocles uh, say that you don't speak ill of the dead. Of the dead, right. Sophocles, I ask, you know, Greek drama, that you don't speak ill of the dead. When a man is dead, you don't kick him. So maybe that's where people will be uh, justified in saying, ah, why should we say that? Particularly in the context of the fact that this is a man who has just died. However, to, to stretch it further, there are issues in the creative industry about morality, about lifestyle, about the kind of choices that artists make. I think the major message that needs to be pushed out there is that, you know, living a certain kind of, life, kind of lifestyle does not necessarily make you a better artist. But there seems to be an emergent culture whereby people think, oh, you can only be creative if you smoke, if you drink, if you join gangs. You don't need to join gangs, okay? And there are examples within that same industry of persons living a straight life, you know, who do not join gangs, who do not smoke, who do not uh, drink. So these, I think, are the basic issues. I don't think that, uh, you know, uh, Pastor Bakari necessarily uh, meant any harm. Right. But you have to understand the context. Right. Generational, you know, and also... Uh, is calling yes. as a pastor. I like that word, context. I mean, I also like the fact that you picked on the fact of uh, don't speak ill of the dead because yes. that's the first thing I thought about and I felt it was quite insensitive because, I mean, Mobad has a mother, has a family. I mean, how would they feel if they hear that their son deserved to die in that context. I mean, that was what my issue was. But Rufa, I'll come to you because also um, there was another story that was trending that, um, you know, the hospital that uh, they said Mubad was uh, put to uh, debunked claims that uh, Mubad was brought in alive there. They said that is, uh, what is it called? Perez Medicare Hospital. They said that the late singer arrived dead, I mean, dead on arrival. So that was another thing I wanted mm. to raise. But, you know, over mm -hmm. to you on the... Uh, so context, on, uh, as it is with Bakari. what's one case we also talked about yesterday was guys the vice president. Uh, it's a lack of sensitivity. And as I use the particular word tact, you can go and check the meaning. It means someone, when somebody lacks sensitivity. I think it's a lack of sensitivity. Uh, Dr. Bati, you wrote an article today at the back page. I always read your articles, lovely ones, where you talked about the fact that we are all Mobad, isn't it? Yeah. And what happened to Mobad could have happened to anybody mm. in our society. And um, all of these things about gang and drugs and everything, it's still the realm of speculation. The police have not even brought out their investigative report. So, yes. Pastor Sunil Bakari has no factual evidence to be able to say that it is based on this lifestyle that the man died. Let's wait for the police to conduct. They've conducted an autopsy. Get it. Let's even see the result and see the cause of death. And they come out with the investigation. So, factually, we don't have the facts. Going back to that article that Dr. Abati wrote, we are all mobiles in society. Because what happened to Mubad opposed to all of us? Is it the family fighting over property and excluding the, the, the girl? Is it the, the, his wife? Is it the fact that everybody wants to jump on the Mubad bad wagon to seek relevance at the expense of Lee and his son? And I just hope all the streaming money Mubad's name and music is making out they use it for Liam. I've been willing to say that. And I just hope that attention is paid to the future of the child. Is it our society you know, that doesn't even give us structure to be able to scale. Nobody wants to set out bad, but our society fails us. So this conundrum about Mobad is a failure of the society. Going back to the point as regards why you have gangster gang violence, all of this were a, rep were a reaction to the repression of the African-Americans over the years. That's how rap music came about. Hip-hop music came about because they were being suppressed. You know, and that's why when you see some of them were repression, look at people like Tupac, for instance. That's how they were reacting to the society. So what has really caused a lot of problem as regards Mobad's death mm -hmm. is the society. Right. And that's why I mix both to say that it is the Nigerian society, the total framework that killed Mobad.